Hey guys, Tony Smith with Dennis and Yachting. We're here at the Palm Beach Boat Show, and I am with... Jack Stringfellow. Jack, this is an awesome boat. This is a 53-foot yacht cat with IPS. I've never seen something like this. Can you explain it? It's pretty outstanding. Uh, the uh, It's a 2016. It's uh, uh, 53 feet. It's 17-foot beam. It does have uh, IPS uh, D13s. They're uh, 1,200 which is, it translates to 1,800 horsepower. Incredible, yeah. incredible. So this is a really top speed of round what? Ah, we cruise at 26 knots and uh, top speed's 34 knots. Okay. And that, that, that fuel burn is uh, what makes this boat unique. We came down from Stewart uh, on Monday. We ran 27 knots in four to six outside and uh, we were burning 64 gallons an hour. Combined. That's incredible, yeah. that's incredible. So this is just really unique to see a fishing machine as a catamaran with the IPS. So let's go ahead and check out the salon and safe rooms and then we'll go from there. Okay, so we're here in the galley. I see we got a U-shaped galley on the porch yeah. side. Can you kind of tell us what we've got for appliances and uh, everything sure. else? Sure, sure. We have, uh, there's four Sub-Zero uh, combination freezer uh, fridge. So we've got, the way the owner has it set up now is uh, almost gourmet kitchen, if you will. I mean, if you think about it. So we've got uh, plenty of freezer space. We've got a full stainless steel sink with a disposal nice cabinetry uh, convection oven. It does have uh, cooktop hidden away here. Okay, the next stop is gonna be down in the state room, so let's check it out. Jack, this is an amazing master. I can't believe how wide this is. Can you explain the master and the configuration? Sure, I can, Tony. It's uh, This is a full beam master forward in the catamaran, so we've taken advantage of the, the full beam and the sponsons either side. Each one uh, had, had put in their, their two cents worth of uh, having a nice vanity, uh, nice secure pull-out seating, uh, drawers and storage everywhere, including underneath the master. This has a uh, motor-operated locked-out storage uh, area. It's also lighted. Uh, storage here, just amazing amount of, uh, of space. And just to clarify, when you said the sponsons, you actually meant the two hulls run the whole way up, and we have a full four-peak of storage. Correct. Here. Yep. Excellent. And so, Tony, this, uh, this ensuite uh, Back, basically shower tub so there's a full-size five-foot tub in here uh, all fiberglass all beautifully done uh, mirrors all the way around plenty of storage in there uh, nice commode nice European style uh, sink and it's worth taking a close look at that there's a three stateroom three head and each one is set up en suite and set up with separate shower so you can imagine the, the accommodations for having guests on board or family uh, you know you got ventilation here you got tons of storage in the floor as well. Yeah, so we have Bose surround system throughout the whole boat, and each uh, stateroom has a television. Of course, the large screen here on center for enjoyment. Same thing in the in the salon. Another mirrored image of that. Uh, great ventilation. This is just powering out some great air right here. So really a good lounge spot to get away from the rest of the crew if you want to come up here and hang out. So this is one of two additional staterooms in the hull. This is a twin setup, uh, 
plenty comfortable with lots of lots of vertical storage, uh, lots of storage again under the bunks as well as overhead, with a uh, nice ventilation as well as it, uh, its own television screen here. So Tony, I wanted to uh, show you the rest of the uh, accommodations on the boat. It, it does have a full washer dryer and laundry center. Separate, separate washer, separate dryer. We have uh, capacity for a water maker is 65 gallons an hour. We have a full stereo system, HD, KVH, uh, quite a nice entertainment center. We're gonna check out the other stateroom. It's over here, it's a VIP, it's a queen. This queen stateroom, uh, again, ensuite head and uh, separate shower. Nice, comfortable space. Again, it has uh, vertical storage. It does have uh, television and its own uh, separate cubby storage there. One of the other features that uh, is well laid out is the mechanical room with easy access to all our uh, battery switches, our Charles uh, inverter, uh, several other mechanicals. And there's a chase that goes literally across the boat for our wire runs and pulls. So it's well thought out. Jack, I gotta tell you, I'm super impressed with this catamaran. It's like nothing I've never seen before. There's one last stop that we need to see, yep. and that's what? Well, let's go to the flybridge. So a few things I noticed here, we've got the direct engine room access underfoot, is that correct? That's correct, yeah. So there's a, there's an inspection hatch just for ease of view, and uh, these are all automated uh, electric lift. So, you know, they're they're safe and they're, they cover the whole uh, whole access room. You could have two men in there working if you needed to. Excellent, and then uh, this is a tackle area? Yeah, tackle area, workstation here, cutting board. Uh, for uh, bait prep, this is a, uh, a fantastic ice machine that actually produces 540 pounds of the best ice you can possibly want That's every awesome. day. All right. uh, you know, you got your electrical, you got a Glen Denning uh, recovery for your cable. Uh, you want to go to the flybridge? Yeah. Okay, so up here in the uh, flybridge, we've got two nice captain's chairs. We've got the, uh, what do they call this steering? Palm Beach style. Palm yep. Beach style. Yep. And then this is very unique. Uh, with yeah, these. so the boat is, of course, a Volvo Penta uh, uh, powered, and we have a joystick control. The joystick is also on the tower at the very highest point of the boat. It's okay. about a 34-foot uh, air clearance. But yeah, super easy for docking. Uh, husband and wife team operate the boat. She can dock it by herself. And you can actually drive this boat sideways. Absolutely, it'll walk directly sideways, just like that, just like any of these big ships here, really, <laughs> literally. So, cool. uh, what yeah. are we looking at for electric? So power? yeah, we have uh, 8216 Garmin's. These are uh, uh, all set up. We've got them, we've got them lit up at the moment. We have engine room cams, uh, so we can monitor our engine room. We have uh, there's additional accessory. This is a custom helm. So the, uh, the owner actually had set it up so that, you know, he could have his ignition uh, uh, start stop here, uh, Volvo, uh, autopilot, control, radio, of course, VHF is here, 12 volt uh, control system, standard Volvo Penta uh, engine monitoring and system. This is really nice because even though all this is a waterproof, they thought to like really protect the electronics. Sure. This will last for decades. Yep. There's lots of storage all the way around. There's a, there's a drink box, there's a cooler drink box as well, which is on. This is a unique feature to the boat. Uh, the owner had designed this so it's a complete walkthrough. 
So by having that access, you've got uh, single-handed, you know, you can drive the boat single-handed, come up and drop your lines on a, on a calm day. It makes it makes it super easy. The non-skid on the boat is, ex is exceptional. Uh, I've got a 100-pound uh, anchor. Of course, windless controls are, are at the helm station. Tony, before we go down back down to the deck, let me show you this. It's a mechanical room the owner had designed. It goes all the way across the helm, so everything is, is all your electrical is accessible if you want to change anything out. You've also, the owner likes to keep his rods and reels in here for just a quick stowage. So nice, nice additional accessory, well thought out. Yeah, that's just another unique feature on this boat that stands out and makes it one of a kind. Yeah. Let's go back down to the back deck. Jack, thanks so much for showing us the ultimate lure. How can people get a hold of you? Well, you can find us right here at the Palm Beach Boat Show, and you can uh, get the information just below the screen there. Come see us. We'll be here through Sunday. For additional information, please feel free to email me at ts at flyachtpro.com. Also, please feel free to text me at 404-805-9819.